Officials in the president's office and defense ministry lost their jobs as Kyiv moved to zero tolerance for corruption that could shake the confidence of Western supporters. Just two days after a gunman killed 11 people at a Los Angeles area dance studio, seven more victims were shot dead in an agricultural area near San Francisco, as California suffered one of its bloodiest spates of mass gun violence in decades. Lawmakers are set to grill top executives from the event ticketing industry on Tuesday after Ticketmaster's inability to process orders for Taylor Swift's upcoming tour left millions of fans unable to buy tickets or without their ticket even after purchase. In his championship Sunday power rankings, Dan Hansis reveals a new pecking order for the four teams still alive in the NFL playoffs, while also slotting the quartet eliminated during the divisional round. Princess Eugenie, the granddaughter of Queen Elizabeth and niece of King Charles, is expecting her second child with husband Jack Brooksbank. A mass shooting at a gas station in Oakland Monday evening killed at least one person and injured at least seven others, the second mass shooting in the Bay Area Monday and the third in California in three days.